Hello and welcome to this quick video about how to use the Worksheet Generator. Selecting the Worksheet Generator from the home page, it will take you to a screen where you can then design your own worksheet. There are three options for every single skill that you add to your worksheet. The first is the particular skill and this skill list will grow over time. So I'm going to select uh, Expand to all More Binomials. Um, here we've got a list of all the skill difficulty levels and I'm going to select a two star and perhaps I want three questions relating to those two stars. You can add as many skills as you like. So I'm going to add in uh, some linear simultaneous equations and I want the three star and perhaps I'll have six questions of those. Uh, you select preview and within a few seconds it will generate your preview of the worksheet. Now at the moment one thing just to bear in mind is that although I've previewed the worksheet once uh, and as you can see from question one I've got x minus three times x minus three. I'm going to clear the preview and preview it again and you can see how question one has now changed. That means that you can create as many worksheets as you like uh, based on these same skills. So I'm going to click create worksheet and within a few seconds a document will be produced and on page one you'll have all the questions that you wanted and then on page two, at the end of the document, you will then have all the answers. So this is how you can create a worksheet using the Worksheet Creator. However, you can see here that you can actually translate this worksheet into 109 different languages. And this is using the uh, Google Translator uh, Chrome extension. Okay, So this is available from the Chrome Web Store. And as you can see, I've already uh, added it to Chrome. So I'm going to click on the extensions tab and then uh, click on Google Translate and it will say translate this page. So when Google Translate is loaded, uh, select on the drop down box and then you can see all available languages. So let's say you're supporting a student with, uh, who is uh, Russian, English is an additional language. Um, we can select Russian and as you can see the whole page is actually being converted into Russian. Uh, we've got the green button here, which was the Create Worksheet button. And if we click on Create Worksheet, we now have exactly the same worksheet, but this time translated into Russian. I hope this feature proves incredibly useful in terms of supporting students with EAL. Uh, do drop me a line on Twitter if you have any, any other suggestions about how this feature could be improved. Thank you for watching.